everybody and welcome back. Um, so this is not an unusual podcast episode, mm. this is more vlog style because at the beginning of this year, at the end of last year, the beginning of this year, I decided to get more organised um, and I'm working towards having or living the life I want to live as opposed to the life I feel I should live. And the only way I can do that is to work on myself and my organisation and be more present. So one of the ways that I have been doing that is to start doing my bougie again. Now I got the plain brown one from Ottoman or Otagami. Um, and I have planned out my year. And alongside those things, I have realised that I keep not having the needles I need or whatever. Um, so I have done this spread for niche needles and crochet hooks. Now, you're probably not going to be able to see it on camera from here. So I took a picture earlier and I'll insert that here. So what I will be doing is going through all my mist needles and crochet hooks, most of which are in here, and tracking them here, and then the ones that I don't have or that I need, I will be ordering online. Now another important thing to mention is that I will be trying to buy needles that I can from people that I know, um, as opposed to on Amazon or eBay, because that's so impersonal. So I know that people like Angela who run Yarn and Yarns has got some of the cables that I need so I'll be ordering them from her. Um, and then there are some uh, indie yarn shops that I've been to like Loop London that have some of the needle tip sizes that I need. So I'll be doing all that once I've tracked what I have and what I don't have. And yeah. So I will see you in a bit when I have finished tracking what I'm doing. So I have finished writing down what I have got, so now I can figure out what I need, which seems to be more than I realised. Um, so on the left here is the size needles, the first column, and then what they're made from, so material and wood, and basically it's just brown tallies are wood and black tallies are metal or carbon. Fixed circular needles. Now circ for me is the tips. So these are on a different cable but that is a tip so that's a circ for me. And then I've got DPNs, double pointed needles, which can also include those the flexi sock needles. Um, I think it's a higher higher or chow do. Um, and then hooks of crochet hooks and cables. So, admittedly, I don't really need to get fixed circular needles. They can be handy for certain projects, um, but I'm sort of veering away from using those. I won't be replacing any of those as they wear out. Um, so I have everything between a two and a half and a four and a half on those. Um, and that's all I use really. Um, 
so when they wear out I won't be replacing them um, but the circulars so the tips I am missing um, quite a few that I use regularly now okay so some of them are in projects um, for example I know that I've got the 3.25 and the 3.75 in the lottery jumper um, and then I've got the same size is also for the Corvus Corax jumper, which you guys haven't seen yet. Um, and then I've got a couple of sets of sock needles and sock projects, and a few other projects that I'm working on that are present projects. Uh, but I've already noted those down because I know what they are, except for the lofty ones which I forgot. So DPNs, I need to get at least three sets, um, and hooks, I need to get more of purely because I don't use them for crochet. When I do my knitting, if I drop a stitch, I like to use the same size hook or very close to put it back. Uh, so I need to get six crochet hooks. So I do have uh, a crochet hook bag which has got lots of crochet hooks in it. But weirdly there is a gap between three and a half mil crochet hook two and a half mil but I use that only for my crochet granny square project um, and then cables I need uh, at least another five cables because I've got some but I don't have enough so yeah that is my Now, when I'm working on a new project, or whatever, or I'm designing it, and I'm, you know, thinking, do I have the right size needle, etc., I can just look here and go, yeah, that gauge works with that. So, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this little vlogmas type video. I know it's not vlogmas anymore. I, I know I sort of jumped off that bandwagon halfway through, but I want to be doing vlog style videos as well as the weekly podcast. I am recording the, the, this week's podcast straight after recording this. Well, yeah. So I hope if any of you have been looking for a way to figure out how to record their needles and things, especially if you don't have access to the Ravelry's needle sort tool thing that you can use in your profile, um, that just something like this would be helpful. Um, yeah. Let me know how you organise yours and track your needles in the comments down below. I'd be very interested to hear and see. And if you make videos about it, um, knitting videos or whatever, also tag me down below and let me know what to see. Because I love watching knitting podcasts and crochet podcasts and sewing and spinning and <laughs> all the rabbit holes. So, yeah. So, I'm back on Angela's website so I'm going to go and order some cables Hi Angela um, and then what I can't get from her I shall find out about. see you all in a bit thanks for joining me bye